an Airbus Group NV military transport plane crashed near Seville, southern Spain, killing four of the people on board, the Spanish government said Saturday. A government official in Seville said the aircraft was carrying six people and crashed in a field about a mile north of Seville's airport, catching fire upon impact. Two people were sent to the hospital with very serious injuries, she said. An Airbus spokesman confirmed the crash of an A400M transport plane on its first flight. The aircraft, which was due for delivery to the Turkish Air Force in June, took off at 12.45 p.m. local time and crashed about 15 minutes later, Airbus said. The Spanish Air Accident Authority, or CIAIAC, is leading the probe into the cause of the crash. Airbus said it had dispatched technical experts to the scene to support the investigation. All six on board were Airbus employees and Spanish nationals, the company said in a statement. Airbus personnel typically perform a series of test flights before aircraft are delivered to customers. The crash is the first of an A400M military airlifter, which Airbus assembles at a plant in Seville. Like commercial airlines, the A400M is equipped with black boxes that record conversations between pilots and the functioning of system. Those two recording devices, which are designed to be able to withstand crashes and fires, could prove crucial in determining the cause of the crash. Investigators will also rely on information from air traffic control to reconstruct what happened. Plane tracking website FlightRadar24 said the aircraft crashed at 12.57 p.m. local time after reaching a maximum altitude of 1,725 feet and then descending at a constant speed of about 160 knots, or 184 miles an hour. The crash is the second big military airplane tragedy in Spain this year. In January, a Greek combat jet crashed on takeoff during a military exercise, killing the two pilots and eight PIOP.